Hello YouTubers and welcome to episode number and today is a bit of a different day obviously I've got to do a workout and it's a Saturday so it seems to mean it's a 3x2k day but I'm not going to the club hmm where will I be going well you'll know from the title where I'm going so I might as well just tell you going into central London to a CrossFit box to someone who I'm chatting to on Instagram. We'll see who that is. But now, I'm just gonna get there, so I'm gonna go park, get the subway, subway, tube, whatever, and then we're getting to work out. Okay, let's get to it. And I've made it into London, just crossing Hammersmith Bridge now. We've got the British rowing boathouse over there, just at the other side of the bridge. All the water. Surprisingly calm day, quite warm. Now we're going to head down to the centre to get to the CrossFit box to do the 3 by 2 k Oh yeah, so lovely tube journey B-roll. Okay, let's get to it. And we've made it into London in the centre now to find the CrossFit box in one of these underneath the railway line one of these somewhere pretty cool let's get to it and it's been located and this must be Ben's ah, this is Ben. good to see you how are we doing good, good to, to see you buddy good to meet you damn you're small <laughs> <laughs> and you too <laughs> so we're going to get some 3 by 2 keys are you looking forward to it yes Oh yeah, let's go. All right, so we're now in central London CrossFit, just getting the ergs set up with Ben's here. Just the two ergs, three by 2K, 22, 24, 26. Just gonna see what happens. Yet to see what splits, but hopefully go faster than the last one. All right, let's get to it. Has just finished our first 2k. What'd you get? 700.9. All right, nice work. And so sitting at 22, a little bit 20 feet then. 6.46 for me. So I'm going to try and go closer to 30 on the next one and then see what's left in the tank for the last one. But we'll soon find out. Okay, let's get to it. And that's just finished our second 2K, 631.7, uh, 6.45.9. Alright, that's a big step on, well done. No. But he's a bit <laughs> breathless now though, <laughs> he's feeling it now. That one did burn a bit, as always the second one. Now in the third one, just have to dig deep in the pain cave at about probably 1500 left. And then we see how fast we can go at rate 26. Alright, let's get to it. Finished the workout. I blew my doors off last 700 to go. 
ended up going high 30s for the last bit. Finished at 624. What'd you get? 641.6. Nice. So stepped on every one. 15 second jump and then a four second jump. So in the pain cave, probably quite a lot on that second one. Yeah. <laughs> nice work. <laughs> Cheers, man. All right. Now, remember, food is fuel, so we're gonna have a feast. Let's get to it. And we've made it into the diner in Soho. So we're getting some milkshake, some Snickers milkshake, some Oreo milkshake with Ben's. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> After the free by 2K, because remember, food is fuel, also getting the, some sort of burger with about 15 patties on it. Dinner, dinner, dirty Di dinner diner, burger. Dirty diner burger, <laughs> oh yeah. So we're gonna eat that and then see what happens. All right, let's get to it. Hello, baby. Ah, oh, and there are the burgers. We've got a triple burger with a fried egg, some onions, another triple burger with some blue cheese and some cheese and onion chips. Absolutely fantastic. Now to eat it, because remember, food is fuel. Got to fuel up after a sweet workout. All right, food time. And we've made it into the Green Park in the middle of London for a little rest, a little bit of a food coma, a little bit. How are you feeling after your 3x2K? Very well, actually. <laughs> I'm feeling the food coma. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's very sleepy, but now it's time to head back to Henley for some rest and recovery. I've also got my a present waiting at the door. We'll see what that is when we get there. Okay, safe trip back to Henley. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, thank you very much, Ben, for the workout today. Thanks for, well, I thank you, man. Oh, Seriously. Much appreciated. <laughs> much appreciated. And I uh, will see you another time for another workout. Uh, maybe for some weights? For Ned. For Ned. And I don't know what sports. that is, <laughs> but he says it's fun. But okay, <laughs> see you at Henley. And we've made it back to the house after a pretty sweet day in London. So I just drove in, got the tube the rest of the way, and then drove back, got the rest of the tube. Got there and back anyway, nice and safe. Great workout with Ben. So I'll put his link, his Instagram in the description below if you want to check it out. He's pretty strong. He's aiming for uh, 200 kilos in the squat and the deadlift. Savage. I wish I could do above 100. <clears throat> Okay, so got back home and look what has arrived. So for those people who pay attention to my Instagram, they'll have seen that I have received a little discount code for this, my cookbox company. So basically what they do is they put in ingredients for meals into said box and then they deliver it to your house once a week and you can choose different different meals, they have different recipes and different amounts of meals. So if you want to have a look, I'll put a link in the description for my cookbox, .co.uk, and then I'll put my uh, discount code on the screen now. So just FIF40 and I'll put it in the description below. If you want to have it just to check it out and let's see what's actually in the box. All right. Okay, so what's in the box? We've got some herbs and stuff here over there I've already taken out. Vegetables on this side like an insulated bag for the cooler stuff and some other tins and whatnot. Pretty sweet, really. I'm just going to make one of the meals. I'm not sure if I'm going for the beef ragu. I think I might go for the smoked lardon. And lardon is essentially bacon with a crispy kale topping. Oh, that sounds delicious. It also gives you like directions on how to do them. Because I need directions. I'm not a professional chef. All right. Oh, yeah. It's one of the things I looked for something like this because I usually eat... I'll eat a lot of food, but my variation in the food is pretty bad. So I'll go for pretty much just like meat, rice, pasta, or some other simple carb, and then some veg, usually broccoli and or some beans or some whatever. But this is giving the opportunity to eat a variation of things because like I say, Variation is one of the main keys to motivation, even if it comes down to your meals. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's see you after I've made the orzotto. Okay, so I've got all the ingredients out for the smoked lardon. And here they are, just all labeled, really. Let's see how much food it makes. So it's my sister and I are going to have some dinner. And it's like, even stuff like this, like chicken stock powder, it's in little tubs. And I think all of it's recyclable, so that's quite good. And then all the stuff is labelled, we've got packs of orzo leeks that are leeks, so don't need labelled, but like, 
the recipe is like, okay, you need this amount and it's all labeled. So that's really handy. Oh, even the little bags of cheese, which are again in recycled packaging. Nice. All right. Let's get to making some food. I ate the food and forgot to film it for you guys, but it was actually really, really good. It was probably, so it fed my sister and I and then there's some leftovers for a little bit for tomorrow. So I think it would probably do two meals for me. And you can take that for how much you think that meal is in quantity. I don't know. But I think that'll be it for the episode for today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. A little bit different. Went to London and it's just a little bit of a refresher. Getting out the bubble of Henley. Because remember, variation is the key to motivation. So not only food, but just changing things up everywhere today. And that'll be it for the episode for today. Remember, subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that like button and have a good one.